Hey man, before we start this video, y'all hit that like button. Y'all hit that subscribe button. Y'all hit that share button. Okay? We about to get to a thousand subscribers. And we, we hitting that like button. We hitting that share button. We hitting that comment. We hitting them comments. Let's go, man. Hoods be in our TV. Big favor. Big abundance. Let's get into the video. What's going on with all my billionaires out there? This the guy, Hoods Billionaire. Welcome to Hoods Billionaire TV. Big favor. Big abundance on today's episode. We're going to be talking about Suki Hana and YK Osiris. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So, this is actually a... um. Uh, a topic from last week that I wanted to touch on that I didn't get a chance to touch on um, in regards to YK Osiris, the rapper, um, was on a show with Suki Hana and he forcibly tried to kiss Suki Hana in the mouth multiple times and she was not feeling that and that led to an awkward moment. Well, YK Osiris ended up apologizing to Suki Hana, saying he misread the moment. I guess they might have been doing, like, some playful flirting, but, you know, he wasn't able to understand, like, that this is just entertainment, and that was done for entertainment purposes, so he really kind of probably got caught in that lust frequency, lust trance, and, you know, wanted to go test Suki Hana out, um... So, how do I feel about this? I feel a multitude of different ways, right? I actually like how Suki Hana handled this, bro. Like, you know, for the energy that she puts off in the type of human being that she is, I'm actually, when I'm hearing her talk, she's c coming off as a very intelligent uh, black woman with a lot of understanding. You know, you like... I, I, who knew you know what i'm saying and i said in a negative way but it's actually coming off that she's a pretty intelligent woman you feel what i'm saying so i feel like the fact that she consciously understands you know a lot of the things that she's going on that means she consciously understands the image that she's putting out right so i would hope that you know at some point suki hana understands that there are a lot of young black girls that look up to her because she has influence okay and i want her to understand that she needs to use her influence to steer these young black queens in the right direction you get me you know now on yk osiris part no means no my nigga you know what i'm saying i mean that's just a clear-cut case of no means no you know what I'm saying? That was uh she wasn't feeling you and you you that was pretty pretty forcibly you doing your thing on her, bro. So we can't I can't speak no positive on that because at the end of the day that's some creep ish. You feel what I'm saying? That's some creep ish, bro. So you you did apologize like a man you did accept your responsibility like a man and luckily for you she's a black woman with some understanding and she not trying to press no line but what you got to understand is bro get off that lust energy you know and that go for all my black men out there bro get off that lust energy bro get some discipline and some self-control you feel me to where that type of even if a woman is putting that type of energy out you're not it doesn't affect you in any way because you're not on the energy of lust you feel what I'm saying? Uh, I could be sitting around 10 women on that type of energy. I'm not even finna really pay it no attention because I'm not on that frequency. I'm not on a lust frequency. So that wouldn't affect me at all. You feel what I'm saying? And we need all our kings to move like that. You know what I'm saying? Especially the ones that's in the spotlight like a YK Osiris, bro. You gotta, you gotta get, have that self-discipline that, you know, to not be on that lust frequency, bro. It is what it is. And look, that's where that got you. Where you just moving unconsciously trying to kiss a woman who really not even on that. She just more so on the entertainment side of it. At the same time, Suki, I just wish that you will understand that it's a lot of young black princesses and a lot of young black queens that look up to you 
because you have the, the the power of influence that God bestowed upon you. Use that influence the right way. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you lead these black queens in the right direction. Make sure you lead these black princesses in the right direction. So they don't have to be out here being hypersexual and extra. You feel what I'm saying? Because I just don't feel like that's the right way to go. You know? That's me personally. You know what I'm saying? It's okay to be liberated and be who you are, but... Put some context on that. You feel what I'm saying? So our young black queens not out here, you know, just moving any type of way. You feel me? It's okay to be a Suki Hana in private. My personal opinion. You feel what I'm saying? I'm okay with my woman having some Suki Hana tendencies in private. You know, not none of that weird stuff. I don't want no, you know, I don't need no extra. I don't need no, you know, none of that. None of that extra stuff that she be on, but you know what I'm saying? I'm just talking about, you know, it's okay to have some freaky tendencies, you know what I'm saying? But you 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 just got to know, I just want to make sure that you illustrating the right type of influence and giving the right type of guidance to the young black queens out there. You feel what I'm saying? Because they watching you. You know, whether you want them to or not. So, but I appreciate you being a strong, a a, a stand up black woman and speaking how you spoke. You know what I'm saying? About the black man and about forgiving that black man. So that's just big salutes to Suki Hana for that. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. It's the guy who's being there. Big favor, big abundance. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. It's the guy who's being there. Big favor, big abundance. I'm gone.